I hope that sock made the wind noise better. Hope y'all can still hear me though, because if you can't, that's gonna be a problem. Um, I love these turn signals, man. Uh, see, I was gonna go up into the park, but now I think I'm not. I can try and pop a wheelie real quick. It honestly kind of scares the shit out of me. I could try. Woo! Alright. Okay. Hope y'all can see that. It, the front wheel is actually coming up. Um, the clutch was slipping before and it didn't actually pull the front wheel up. And now let's see if I can... See if I can get another one here. Woo! Let me try one more. Alright. That's enough dicking around. that fix the wind noise and I hope y'all can still hear me because uh, I really need to do a review on these turn signals they're awesome but yeah I'll drive slow so y'all can hear me a little bit better um, tried to record a vlog yesterday and it didn't it didn't want to save it so Here's a vlog. This thing runs, and it runs really, really good. Um, oh, shit. Um, I think the clutch was really causing all the problems with this because, I mean, it will pull the front end up on power alone. Like, I don't even have to sit off the back of the seat for it to pull the wheel up. It does it on power alone. Um... The, the engine doesn't bog out and die whenever I stop. It doesn't, none of that weird shit. We're good. Needs a new tire, but I mean, I'm not really going to worry about it. All right. See if I can pop one real quick. Alright, I just gotta... Woo! Okay. Okay. I did one yesterday and I almost loot the damn thing. I gotta get used to it. Is that okay? I'm gonna be really careful and go in over here. Yep, this works. This works well. Um. Yeah. So I know I said I wanted to do the 171 kit. I've said it basically every video. I mean, not not every video, but I've brought it up a lot. Um, how this thing is right now, like as it sits right now, with the new clutch and the taller gearing and stuff. Ah, oh, shit, that's a park truck. Shit. Hope y'all can see that. Um, that's kind of why I don't do any off-road videos. Oh my god, this thing sounds mean. Listen to it. Um, 
We can try to go hoon over here. I gotta be careful because it'll do a burnout in the grass that I'm even trying. All right, let's go. Oh, shit. Woo! I'm not gonna know how bad this audio is until I review the video. So. I mean, if it's... If it's like only a little bit muffled, but it's not that bad, I'll still upload it. But if it's if it's unbearable, I'm not gonna try to upload it at all. So I'm not gonna do anything top speed today because I really kind of want to just drive this thing a little bit easier and test it out, see if there's any problems. That's a fed, isn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. Okay. Let's go over here. Go over to the hill. This isn't where I came up yesterday, but we can still see if she can make it up. Oh, yes. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a fad. Um, oh, shit. This is like 20 feet just straight down. Oh, my God. But yeah, um, it used to do these weird little things where like, if you were rolling down a hill, it would roll freely, and then you would go to get on the gas and it would almost stop before it started going again. It doesn't do that anymore. Um, when it would get hot, I guess the, uh, the clutch would pull on the engine and that's what was making the moped die out of nowhere. Is that a table? Bro, can I load this? I'll come back for it. I'll come back for it on foot. But yeah, I've been driving it for probably two or three days. Um, obviously, me jump-starting it the way that I do isn't good for it, but I'm going to get a kickstart. I ordered a kickstart. There's the burnout from yesterday. This thing makes some serious power now. Like, it makes torque. So, he put heavier weights in the variator. I know I have an accent. Y'all are just going to have to deal with it. I can't really change it or anything. But, yeah. He put heavier weights in here. So, basically the weights slide out slower because they're heavier so you have less acceleration but because they have more weight they can push out against the face of the variator with more force making the variator come out more and so you get more top speed this thing honestly still has a fuckload of acceleration though like really like I can just sit normally like I am right now and this thing will lift the front wheel up a little bit if I, if I like, gas it and kind of pull back on the bars a little bit. It's insane. See if it does that. Nope. Doesn't stop whenever you go to get on the gas. It just goes. Just giving y'all a real good picture of where I live, basically. Can we drag the knee? Oh, shit. That back tire slips so bad. That tire, man. Let's see if I can get a little bit of speed in here. I'll wait on all the cars to go. 
as a car driver, you're supposed to yield to smaller vehicles such as bikes and motorcycles, but a lot of people don't understand that. And they just assume that you'll get out of the way or whatever, and so they don't stop a lot of the time. Uh, yeah, this thing is fully back in order. Definitely more moped videos coming soon, depending on how much free time I have. I should have a lot. Um, and the weather is about to warm up. It's not really warm right now. It's like 53, I think. I still got my turn signal on. But yeah, I will definitely do a review on these turn signals because... They look good. They're really easy to install. Um, they work great. They're really bright. There is... Yeah, I, am, I do think I am going to make a video on it. Because there's a bit of a difference with the procedure of the one that's not the throttle and this one. This one, you have to do a little bit more finagling like I did. But... It, it'll still fit. I'll go over like the little rubber stoppers they put in them to um, to ensure that they don't come out. And yeah, I'll do a full in-depth review. My only complaint, actually, I'll pull over here quick so y'all can actually see it. But yeah, this thing doesn't bog anymore. It doesn't. The idle doesn't go up and down. It's just, it's solid. Um, let me pull over here and show y'all. So, my tail light, which I have back here. Hope, I hope y'all can see it. I can't really see the phone. But, um, my tail light is a rechargeable LED. So, if it goes dead, I can just take it in and charge it. These turn signals, however, um, they run off of, like, the big watch batteries, so, I know the camera's gonna be, oh, did it just start bogging? Hang on. Nah. But, um, that's, like, my only complaint about them, but, ideally, what I want for this is... As little stuff on the wiring harness as possible. Like I want, like it is right now, just the essentials for the engine to run is what I want. Because I'm not going to say that my uncle who gave this to me is like dumb or anything. He's really smart, but uh, did it just bog? Hang on. It's bogging. Out of gas. Yeah, it's low on gas. 